Hey, uh, newbie, uh, punch some holes in these documents, will you? Huh? Uh, punch it? Okay. Yeah! What? What the hell are you doing? What do you mean? I'm punching holes. I didn't say literally punch the paper to make holes. I meant use a hole puncher. God. You're done. You're fired. Get out of here. Uh, I'm fired again. This time I was fired after three days. That was short. My name is Hajime. I'm 18. I'm home. What the heck? It smells so burnt. What's going on? I lost my parents three years ago, so I've been living with my sister, Hikari. Uh, sorry, I tried to make something for you, but I kind of screwed up. After I graduated middle school, I started working. Why? For my adorable sister, of course. <sighs> you really can't do anything, huh? I'm not bragging, but my sister is cute and smart. What do you mean? Wait, what are you doing? You can't tell? I'm making cup noodles. Uh, what about your meal? I don't need it. You're, you're kidding, right? You're gonna take cup noodles of your brother's loving meal? She used to say my meals were the best. Oh, this must be puberty. She used to be so cute, but then around the time she started her freshman year... Hey, about what I want to do with my academic career. I'm not gonna go to high school. No, you're smart. You need to go to high school. I don't want that advice. I'm going to become a model and be popular all over the world. You can be a model after you finish school. First, you continue your education. It's my life! You should let me live it! Stop butting in! I hate you! I hate you! Uh, my dearly beloved sister said she hates me. There's nothing worse, but I have to do this for her. She ended up going to school, but she's been cold to me since. How do you forget to put on a part? Uh, I'm so sorry, sir. Hey, Matsuzaki! Sir? You worked on that client's car, right? N no it wasn't me it was him. I told him to put the part on. I found a car mechanic job next, but... What the hell, man? How do you forget to put the part on? Huh? Me? Stop acting like you don't know, you freaking dropouts. Was it because of my educational background, or was it really my fault? I was often blamed. Hajime-chi! When this happens, you just drink your money money soda and relax. <sighs> Thank you, Mr. Kate. <laughs> You're soaked. Aw, I thought I could be a cool co-worker, but I ruined it. This kind of thing continued for a while before one weekend, I was going to a soccer club meet. Come on, hard time guys, huddle up. Is that Hikari's brother? My name is Maki. I've been with Hikari since elementary school, and I know a lot about her brother, too. All right, we're going to have employees versus part-time, but uh, realistically, we're just going to cater to the employees. We need to make sure they're able to feel good about playing us and don't make the mistake of actually winning. Understood! Understood. The opponents are just part-time workers. They're not going to be a tough team to beat. Look at that dropout. He looks like he can't move at all. <laughs> this is going to be easy. Keita! Pass! Got it! Whoa! Uh, uh, hey, you! Oh crap, we scored a point. <laughs> Look at this guy falling! Lucky that went in, huh? Phew. Alright, it's our turn now. Sir! Boss, it's yours! On it! A nice job, boss! Man, high school soccer players are something else, huh? <laughs> That's old times. The part-timers are getting tired. Let's take a break. Sir! Sir! Great job, boys. We're going to let them score and we're going to lose. If we win, you're getting a pay cut. Got it? If you want to work under better conditions, you do your best to make them feel good with soccer. All right. Let's get started with the second half. <sighs> this isn't soccer. Captain, yours! Got it. Hajime, right side, it's open! Leave it to me! Three opponents. I got this! Whoa, what the? Huh? Whoa! Goal! Man, I knew Hikari's brother was insane! 
Phew, this is great! You gotta take soccer seriously, or it's not really soccer. But right around the part where Hikari's brother started scoring points, the whole mood changed. For some reason, literally everyone was trying to steal the ball from Hikari's brother. What's going on? His team is getting in his way too. It's basically 20 versus 1. Hajimechi, over here! Keita, it's yours! Oh, but I guess that guy who has a weird tentacle thing coming out of his head is actually playing. Bang! We won! Hajibechi, we won! We did it! But, uh, we really did it now. I'm sorry for dragging you into this mess. Ah, uh, you don't need to apologize. Soccer was so much fun! But, uh, I won't be able to work there anymore. Don't worry! I was actually gonna start selling things over at the high school, too! I'll introduce you to a new workplace! And then... I started working at a new factory with Mr. Keita's referral. It was going well and I was getting paid well, but... Hey, uh, you wanna work overnight? Overnight? Yeah, it's twice the regular pay. I don't think it's a bad deal. Overnight, huh? That means Hikari will be alone. Um, let me think about it. That night, it happened. I'm home! Yo! Huh? Who are you? He's my boyfriend. Boyfriend? Hikari brought home her boyfriend. I heard a lot about you in your home. But you really are wearing your uniform in your home. You really give off dropout vibes, huh? Seriously, I can't believe that I'm related to this guy at all. Don't tell everyone. Oh yeah, I'm going to be staying over at his place starting today. What? Huh? Why? I'm rich, so if Hikari comes with me, I'll feed her a lot of good things. That's cool with you, right bro? Hikari said she didn't want to leave her own family all alone, so I came here to get your permission. Hey! Hmm, <laughs> is that true? Um... Just so you know, we're not related. Huh? What do you mean? Well, that's literally it. So you really don't have to worry about it. I'm also going to be staying overnight, so I won't be home for a while. I don't care where you go, Hikari. A few months earlier, right after Hikari started high school... That girl apparently scored first on the entrance exams! Whoa, she's so pretty though! How can you be pretty and smart? That's not even fair! Hikari was a popular girl from the get-go. The guy that was asking her out? Hey, you should go out with me. If you go out with me, you can live a nice life. This man must have left a bad first impression on her. Let me think about it. Hikari had another weird look. The same look she had that day. Something was up. What's wrong? Nothing. Is it about Shintaro? No. Apparently I wasn't related to that dropout brother. On the very same day Hikari told me? Dude, I'm so jealous. Seriously, my life would basically be set if I could go out with a girl like that. I mean, she's just a toy. I'll use her up and toss her. <laughs> Whoa, look at the playboy. That's the longest you've dated. Uh, three months? Yeah, something like that. Oh yeah, I'm gonna call her out to the park tonight to take some photos. You guys wanna come? Photos? I felt that something was completely off. I went straight to Hikari. Hikari, you shouldn't be with that guy. He was talking to his friends or something about photos. I'm sure they're up to no good. I know that he's an ass. But it's better than being with that dropout brother. But you have to take care of yourself. I... I've been taking care of too much. Hikari, you... Come on, take it off. You're my girl, right? N no I don't want to. If you want to eat, then you listen to me. Your brother already left, right? Oh wait, he's not your real brother. I started dating Shintaro the second I started high school. What are you going to do with my photos? I'm going to sell them, duh. I knew that he was an ass to begin with. I just didn't realize as much of one. <laughs> you look good at least, so it'll sell for a lot. This is the path I chose. I didn't want to be with a prick like this. 
I was gonna work as soon as I graduated middle school, so... I would live with my brother and eat his terrible food and live happily ever after. But he didn't allow it. He quit his favorite hobby, soccer, to work so he could send me to school. If I don't do this, I'm going to keep making my brother sacrifice everything for me, so... Even if it's trash like this, I need to go out with him and leave so my brother will hate me. Then he'll be free of me. This is fine. Come on, show us your t- uh. What are you doing to my sister? Hajime! I heard everything from Maki. You don't need to worry. Come home. Uh, I'm sorry! I just didn't feel right making you sacrifice yourself for me! You're not the only one. I thought that if I said we weren't related, you'd leave without remorse. I'm sorry. Hajime! We're all that's left. Let's work together, huh? Yeah! Alright, so uh, before we go home... You little shits! Ah! <laughs> Crap, I burned it again! Come on, you ruined it again! I said sorry. The boys were called up by the principal and suspended. Word spread of their doings and everyone shunned them so they have a great school life to look forward to. My brother. Left! The left's wide open! Come on, defense! The boys' soccer club member saw him kicking butt at his soccer meet and decided that he would be a great coach. You got this, Hajime! Hajimechi! Woohoo! There, cover it! Great job! I'm not going to be in the game, goofballs. He's able to work while taking part in his favorite sport, soccer. Looking for more interesting stories and videos? Then come check out other videos from Mani Mani people here. We'd love to hear your thoughts, too. Drop a line in the comments below. See you soon!